Hi, this is John from EcoGear FX, and today we're taking a look at the EcoGear FX TK120 Tactical Flashlight. The EcoGear TK120 Tactical Flashlight is a bright LED flashlight with a zoom function and five light modes. It's made of aircraft grade aluminum alloy and is water resistant, anti abrasive, and shock proof. Unlike knockoffs that use counterfeit components, the EcoGear TK120 uses a genuine, high-quality LED bulb that delivers ultra-bright light. Appearances can be very deceiving, so don't settle for an inferior flashlight. EcoGear is the actual manufacturer of its products and stands behind its products. Beware of imitations. EcoGear FX manufactures quality products. Another great feature of the EcoGear TK120 flashlight is that it utilizes multiple power sources. You can choose between one EcoGear 18650 rechargeable lithium-ion battery or three AAA alkaline batteries. Your EcoGear TK120 will always be ready to tackle your most demanding lighting needs. Today's video is going to take a look at the Nightcore SRT7 GT flashlight. This 1000 lumen multicolor LED tactical light is an upgrade from the SR27 featuring an improved main LED as well as a new UV feature. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at the light. The SRT7 GT is a high performance tactical light with plenty of features useful for military, law enforcement, and hunters. Here the SRT7 GT features a Cree XPO high V free LED and a smooth elongated reflector for up to 1000 lumens of output and 492 yards of throw. You can also see it has four auxiliary color LEDs, one for red, green, blue, and ultraviolet around the outside of the reflector. These color LEDs can be used for a variety of tasks including night vision preservation, map reading, blood tracking, currency identification, and hunting. Built to be tough, the SRT7 GT is easily weapon mountable and compatible with Nightcore's RSW1 pressure switch. The body features diamond knurling and key locations for enhanced grip, which is especially useful while wearing gloves. The SRT or Smart Ring series of flashlights uses a twistable ring to cycle through modes and adjust brightness. Use the tail cap to turn the flashlight on and off and the selector located on the bezel to change outputs. Starting with the ring turned as far as it can clockwise and rotating counterclockwise, the SRT7 GT has strobe followed by a 1000 lumen turbo. From here the brightness can be adjusted infinitely down to a half lumen. Continuing on, the next mode is standby followed by UV, red, green, blue, red and blue flashing, and finally beacon. Here are some shots of the color beams, and finally a look at the main output as it cycles from half a lumen to 1000 lumens. The next generation of Surefire tactical flashlights, powered by 123A lithium batteries, are here today. Each model features a high performance LED and a micro textured reflector that create a blinding 200 lumen beam of white light with two hours of tactical runtime. These single output lights are activated by a tactical tail cap switch, which makes them simple to operate in high stress situations where a surge of adrenaline can lead to loss of dexterity and tunnel vision. I'm a police officer, and believe me, solid training and simple gear are vital when you're in harm's way. This is a single output 6PX tactical with a tactical tail cap switch. Push for momentary on activation. You can also twist the tail cap for constant on. This light features a sculpted body, machined from high strength aerospace aluminum that's been hard anodized. It's extremely durable and can be securely inserted and easily removed from Surefire's V85A holster. Here's the G2X tactical flashlight. It has the same capabilities in hard anodized aluminum head as a 6PX tactical, but it features a nitrolon polymer body that makes it a little lighter in weight and a bit easier to hold with bare hands in cold weather. This is the G2ZX combat light. Like the G2X tactical, it has an aluminum head and a polymer body, but it features Surefire's combat grip design with step-down body and rubber grip ring. Why the special body? The combat grip is perfect for the Surefire flashlight technique. This light was designed with law enforcement in mind, 
and it's really ideal for any handgun flashlight technique. This syringe style technique is also useful without a handgun. Here's the all aluminum version, the Z2X, with its combat grip like the G2ZX, but this model has a bit more weight, which is something I personally like. It was based on Surefire's original Z2 combat light that was standard issue for the FBI. A simple counterclockwise twist disables a light so there can be no accidental activation during transport or storage, a feature all of these lights share. Rounding out Surefire's next generation of tactical flashlights is a 6PX Defender, which features a crenellated strike bezel. It's more for civilians who want a last line of defense in case a blast of overwhelming light is not enough to deter an attacker. This is a 200 lumen single output light and features a click type switch, which many civilians prefer. Just press for momentary on activation, press further to click constant on. Like every other light in this video, it easily fits in a Surefire's V85A holster. Surefire also makes dual output pro models that lead with a long running low output 15 lumen beam, followed by a high output 200 lumen beam. This non-tactical programming makes it great for everyday use or the great outdoors, where extended runtime and not blinding white light is often more crucial. Whichever Surefire tactical light you choose, you'll get intense, simple to activate white light that will enable you to separate friend from foe, overwhelm the dark adaptive vision of an aggressor, and lock onto your target. The Surefire E2D LED Defender is a dual output personal defense flashlight. It features a sleek, rugged body made of hard anodized aluminum and a strike bezel as a last line of defense just in case. Press or click once for a tactical level B, enough to temporarily blind an attacker or reach deep into the darkness. To turn it off and press or click on again for a 5 lumen low output beam with extended runtime. The E2DL boasts a highly efficient LED emitter and a precisely molded TIR lens that produces a smooth, tight, far-reaching beam. It runs on two 123A lithium batteries and features Surefire's patented lockout tail cap to keep it from activating when stored or transported. The Surefire E2D LED Defender, a powerful and brutally tough personal defense light only from Surefire. If you're interested in buying one of these products, links to all the products mentioned in this video are in the description down below. If you like and found this video helpful, don't forget to give a like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching.